on May 28th when he sent an email, this email, to the school board after he found out about the alleged sexual assault of a 14-year-old girl by a boy wearing a skirt in a girl's bathroom at Stonebridge High School. In the email, you see more bothered by the fact that the girl's dad was at the school using profanity after his daughter had been allegedly raped than about the rape itself. Why is that, Mr. Ziegler? Also, why at the June school board meeting did you state that the district had no record of sexual assault in bathrooms, knowing full well an alleged sexual assault had occurred a month prior? Did it have anything to do with the transgender policy that you were determined to enact that was opposed by the majority of the parents in our county? How convenient. Also, why was the same boy who was wearing a skirt in the first alleged rape allowed to be moved to a new school and allegedly attacked another girl? Parents want answers to these questions, Mr. Ziegler. You make more than $200,000 a year. Apparently, that's not enough to motivate you to keep our children safe. One thing is certain, Mr. Ziegler, you and Brother Bibaraj need to be fired. Our children deserve better than this. Free mail.